video, I want to share a few words about Trump because I know that there are so many people that hating Trump. They do not understand why do they hate. Somebody told them to hate, so they hate. So they, they are in anger and they are controlled by anger. They don't know why, because they don't understand those levels of consciousness. And there are so many of them. Oh my gosh, there are so many of them. So I will tell you my experience. Uh, I like Trump. I remember when I went to, to my friend's house, to Florida, and uh, there was a Polish lady. She saw Trump there uh, in TV, and, and she said, oh, I hate, and she said to me, I hate that person. And believe or not, at that time, I didn't know Trump. I did not know existence of that person. So when I came back, uh, to my house in Canada, I started to search what I wanted to know about Trump. Because usually when there is so much hate to one person, uh, it's from, I, I have a habit, I might say, to find out more about that person. Why that Polish lady hated so much Trump? And then I understood after my search, I understood right away that she hated Trump because he was rich. So she came from Poland to America. She was not able to learn English. She was for so many years. She, she took jobs wherever she could without language. And she could not understand why she's not satisfied there. She was working hard, but she, she couldn't figure it out why. And I knew that uh, first was basically English. If you are coming from other country and you are not learning language of the country that you want to stay, don't expect miracles to happen to you. First, first what I understood when I came, First language has to be learned. There was not an option. And I put so much pressure on myself when I came. My room, the one that I was renting at that time, was full of English words because I wanted to be around English words. I took workplace only with English-speaking people. I didn't want to be around Polish people. I had Polish friends, don't get me wrong. But I wanted to be in English-speaking uh, community as much as possible, because I wanted to learn. And it didn't come so easily, that language, English language to me. It didn't, took years of mastering, of repeating the same word over and over again. So her experience was different. She was in the best country to make it in the world, but she was not able because of the barrier of language. She refused. She was maybe, I don't know, not aware that that was the first step to do when you are in the foreign country and you want to be part of that country. To back to Trump, uh, I started to read books, recommendations, because he had like a business mind. And I wanted to know what does it take to have that mind. And Probably not many people know that he was a very good leader. Because of him, I learned so much about others. He recommended so many good books for me. The one of recommendation was William F. Buckley. Also, Thomas Sowell as well. So I learned from him a lot. And people think that he is stupid, right? No, he is not. 
he's a very well read person. And uh, when I was thinking to, to have my own business, he was the perfect person to learn from. Perfect. D did you did you read any of his books? You might say I don't care because I hate him. See, you put that barrier in front of yourself because somebody, somebody told you to hate Trump. Do you know who was that somebody? You probably don't even know, but those people who told you to hate are simply a losers because uh, they were using blame they convince you to to hate so their blame could be justified so <laughs> you let yourself to be Trapped. Hmm. Get smarter, my friend. Because we are in fight right now for truth. If you are still hating Trump, you are a loser. <laughs>